What's up? <laughs> hey, let me tell you guys a secret. I have not officially ever been to the Mississippi River. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. I've okay. driven over it on the interstate and stuff like that, so you like blink, you miss it kind of thing. But guess what I realized today, which is why we stopped here and didn't took a bunch of photos. We are officially on the upper Mississippi River. Okay. So yeah. Ooh, look at that. I've officially been to the Mississippi River, and so have you, haven't you? Nope. And I haven't oh, been now you have. Now you have, is Yay. what I'm saying. Now you have. This the is a beautiful. River. It's absolutely gorgeous. And nobody's here to bother us. And We're still technically in Minnesota. We will let you guys know when we get to our next destination. Yes. I'm so in love with See you soon. Yeah, that's my girl in the passenger seat. When is they all dancing around causing a scene? That's my girl. What's up, you guys? Yeah, so, um. We are. Where? We're in Iowa. Wait, we're supposed to say it together. We are. Where? Iowa! Iowa. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, it's crazy because Iowa is kind of mixed with this whole thing. Um, there's some places that are still closed. But, like, 80% of all the restaurants and stores are open. They're just doing the, the dispersed the seating inside. Mm -hmm. And it's so freaking weird, different. But you know what? I'm so glad that we've been able to find places open. Yes, you know? yes. It's a real blessing, too, that we have found so many people here that very they nice believe people. in God. Mm -hmm. And they're very friendly. And they always want to talk about God. Yes. It's well, so crazy cool. Like I was wearing this. Uh, I just want I just to. Want nap, he, I just want to love Jesus and take nap shirt. Right, right. So I told my husband like the coffee that we had earlier in the morning. Yeah, that uh, was. That I couldn't. Was bad. I couldn't. I couldn't drink it. Yeah. So he knew with my with my uh, moodiness. He's yeah. like, you need coffee. Time you to need get some coffee. Real coffee. So he's like, I'm like, well, let's go to the gas station. I'm like. He's like, no, we're going to go to a real coffee shop. So we ended up coming here to this little town <laughs> called Decora. And the place uh, called Java, Java John's. Java John's Coffee Stop. Cute place. So I walk yeah. in, and there's four beautiful ladies, older ladies, you know. Yeah. They were sitting in the corner. Part, of, like, the, part oh. of the local coffee club. And, yeah. <laughs> and they're like, Oh, we love your, sh your your shirt. Oh my God, you know. I'm like, oh, thank you, you know. And, we and then we end up talking. God, oh my God, it's amazing. Pandemic thing. I mean, and, and how the, all the, the economy has has slowly begun to open up. We've been talking about the word. We've been talking about how God's impacted our lives, and we were going back and forth with this conversation for over and an I, hour. And how the lady, one of the ladies, she goes like, you know what? I believe that God brought you guys. Yes. To me, for, to have appointment. a divine appointment and to have a yes. better prayer life. Man, that was like, oh that my God. That was so inspirational to hear, hear them say that. It really was. Like, that's not something you hear every day. No. But when you do hear it, it really hits home. Yes. It means that we are doing what we were are meant to do amen you know amen and i couldn't be happier to know that people really want us out here on the streets praying for people 
you know? Yes. So this trip by far has been one of the best. Oh my goodness, yes. So. Yes. Well, if you guys get a chance, get here to Decorah, Iowa. Decorah, beautiful. Iowa, it's beautiful. It's right on this little ridge of, I call them short mountains. Oh, you know, let me whoops. show you, let me show you, let me flip it. Yeah. See that? It's right on this ridge with the little um, short Hill. mountains or whatever. I call them hills. It's a cute little They're, place. They joke around here and they say that they, they joke around here and say that they live in a crater. And they call it God's country here. So if you guys ever get a chance, get here to Decoro, Iowa and bless these people. It's it's such a wonderful community. And I know for, for I can speak for both of us, we will be back here. Oh we yeah. We will definitely be back. Oh here. yeah. The lady Cody invited us uh, yes. back and they invited us back for coffee already and we yes. just met them. <laughs> so beautiful. And right. we got to pray for them too. Yes, we got to pray we for them. We got to too. pray for them. They're like, wow. It's like, whoever thought that we will meet What's that? beautiful people. Five people so far that we prayed for today? Four, five, six people. Six people. Six people, six people yeah. today. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. Beautiful. All right. All right. We will see you guys soon. Bye. for you, baby. See that? Ooh, what is that? Stay. Uh -uh. Stay. Don't stay up there. No, no. Get up. Stay. Hi. Let me figure out how to open this up. What is it? So it's okay to give it the whole thing then? Yeah. It's a dog bone. She'll chew on it. Yeah. This is basically a ham bone. This is one of the best bones to give to Just a Just give it one piece first, and then see. that one, and then the rest for the other one later. Oh, wow. <sighs> Come on, baby. Uh, let me get my knife. Stay. Oh, yeah, I forgot you had a knife. Sit. Who's a good girl? Sit. Stay. Stay. Girl. Yeah. Good? Yeah. And she's happy with her bone. Yeah. And a nice. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Man, it's been a long day of driving. <laughs> A long been a great night. day though. <laughs> Amazing. Been a great day. Prayed for a lot of people today. That's so awesome. Been a blessing. Um, more like obeying God's voice. No. Yeah, it's. Um, I'm learning all over again to just. Be patient and let him direct my path. You know, even on a on a phys on a physical level. You know, um, 
like where to go even, you know, um, not just who to walk up to, not just who to talk to, but like where to even go, you know, so mm -hmm. at the same time, it's, it's teaching her to do the same thing, you know, and it, to me, to have her learn right alongside me, that just, that means so much more. Mm -hmm. Um, because it's more impactful when we learn together, you know? Amen. Amen. So. I want to say, I want to share something real quick. Um, this whole experience after praying for somebody is so rewarding. It is so rewarding you know um the feeling like man if i feel like this it's the feeling so reward imagine how god feels man on the mm -hmm. throne yeah you know i just i can picture him saying well done my children well done mm -hmm. you know yeah I, I couldn't agree more um it's not a sense of pride. It's just um, a peace and a satisfaction knowing that you've been attentive and obedient to what what the Father's asked you to do. Amen. And to me, that just that means so much more than just living life on an on a day-to-day -day basis, you know? Anyway, um, yeah, on that note, I think we're gonna call it a night. Oh, yeah. We will see you guys mañana. Mañana. Oh.